Hey, I'm Laura with the Canadian Museum of Nature. You've likely heard in the news the big discovery of one of the lost ships from the ill-fated Franklin expedition. Sir John Franklin, of course, being the British explorer who was determined to find the Northwest Passage in the early 1800s. What you might be surprised to learn is that here in our museum collections, we have amazing artifacts from Franklin's last voyage. Scott, when and where were these artifacts discovered? These artifacts were discovered in 1992 off the coast of King William Island in what is now Nunavut, uh, and they were found over 150 years after the crew of the Franklin Expedition was forced to abandon their ships after they had become trapped in the sea ice. So what we have here is a, a representative selection of some of the uh, items that were recovered from the archaeological site. Uh, you can see here we have some nails, uh, a piece of canvas, as well as a metal hinge, uh, a thimble, and uh, a bone button. So currently at the Canadian Museum of Nature, we are housing some of the uh, archaeological collections from Nunavut, as well as their fossil collections through a special agreement with the government of Nunavut. Uh, so we will be curating them here for a, a brief period of time. It's really something, it's mind-blowing actually, to be able to look at these real objects from this ill-fated, tragic event. It's like stepping back in history. But thank you so much, Scott. You're very welcome. Mark, why is it so important for museums like ours to safeguard such collections? Why is the past so relevant to the present and to the future? Laura, people have an ongoing fascination with extreme environments like the Arctic. The fascination includes a passion for exploration and discovery. And like those who explored the Northwest Passage and those who searched for the past explorers, like Franklin, scientists have a long-term relationship investigating natural history in the North. The Government of Canada is dedicated to supporting the museum's collections-based explorations um, in the North, and they also support the important process of helping us to remember what we've discovered. Like the remains of the Franklin Expedition, our discovery of plants, fossils, animals, and minerals are conserved as evidence of what's important to us. The museum's collections and related information are conserved and available as subjects for future studies, and they help Canadians understand the natural resources and the vast natural environment of our country. Thanks for joining us to get a rare behind the scenes look at priceless remnants from Franklin's last and doomed voyage. See you soon for our next Nature Scoop.